guys, welcome back to another Tech Guru video. So today we're going to take a look at the new Inbox app from the Gmail team over at Google. So this is a new uh, vision they have for email. So they released this app. It's by invite only. So I'll uh, drop the link below where you can go if you are interested in getting an invite for this application. It is for Android, iOS, and the web, Google Chrome, obviously. Uh, and it is just a new way that they re-envisioned Gmail. So as you can see here, uh, basically it looks a whole lot different. I'm going to go ahead and flare this out on the side here. These things here that you see, all of these groups of emails these are called bundles so let's go ahead and check out the social bundle here so obviously this is going to be where all of your YouTube Twitter Facebook all of your social media stuff will be bundled now with these bundles you can do a few different things so you can remove these from the specific bundle that it's in you can move them to other bundles you can pin certain uh, emails so if I want to pin this one here I can click on that pin there and it will stay uh, on my inbox so I can always look at it until I'm finished with it now what happens if I'm finished with an email. Well, the way they're doing it with an inbox is they're calling it sweep. So if I hit the check box right here, uh, as I hover over a specific email, or I can even hover over a specific bundle of emails, and then I click on that check mark, it will automatically be marked as done. They call this sweeping, okay? Now this is not deleting the email, this is just getting it out of your vision so you can focus on things that you have pinned to your email. So we're gonna go ahead and click this once more to go back to the overview look. And as we see here, we get individual emails, and as you can see, the ones that have the pin on them, that have the blue up there, there will stay available until you mark them as done, until you handle that specific email. I like this. This is going to allow you to get more stuff done and able to get all of the trash crap, that kind of stuff out of the way. So if we click on the promos bundle here and I'm like, you know what, this is just a bunch of promotions. I'm done with all this. I don't want to look at them anymore. I can click this check here and that will say more than 25 messages in this bundle will be swept away as done. And then I click sweep and I don't have to look at them any longer. Uh, it automatically bundles stuff like finance, updates, promotions, social, things like that. It also bundles your purchases. So you purchase something from Amazon or Netflix or uh, the app store, it'll all be under your purchase purchases there. So let's go ahead and dive into an email. So if we have an email here, we can do a few different things. So you can type in a reminder here to remind you something about that specific email, or you can even go up to this little time or clock icon and you can snooze until a specific time. So I can click on next week and then now that email won't even show up in my inbox until next week. Uh, you can do that with a whole bundle of emails. So I can uh, check on this update right here and then click that little flare icon and then I can even move those uh, to a different type of bundle or Think of it as a label or a group of emails. Uh, so we have our finance, our social and updates and forums. So basically it's like Google now merged with Gmail. Uh, and also they're trying to get you to view more of the email. So as you see under the social tab here, I'm able to see kind of what video people are commenting on. Uh, and they're trying to show me more without me having to dive into that specific email. That way I can look at it at a glance and say, oh, it's about that video or, oh, this email is from Bob or whoever it may be. Uh, another Another thing that you're going to notice is down here in the lower right hand corner where you see the compose icon, I can hover over that. It will then uh, hover over different individuals that I may have recently uh, emailed, or I can even click on this reminder button here, click that, and then type in a reminder. And then this reminder, if I save it, will then be pinned under my inbox right here. So until I'm done and sweep that away with the checkbox like that, it will remind me to do something within my email. So it's kind of like combining a to-do list or a task list with your email. So let's go ahead and flare this out once more to show you a few other things. And then Basically what you can do is, let's say I go and I pin a few emails. So I'm gonna go here, I'm going to pin this email, I'm going to go here, and I'm going to pin this email. If I flip a switch up here in the upper right hand corner, I can click this and it'll only show me stuff that I have pinned. So if you have important emails and you get into your email and you're like, I only have time to get stuff done that I really need to do. You can just switch this right here to go from your whole you know, mess of email and then click that switch right there and then boom, it just shows you this is all I wanna look at today is my pinned emails. I wanna to get to the stuff that's important and get rid of all of the other stuff. That right there, in my opinion, is very, very beneficial. You have your normal search feature here that you can click on the search bar. It's just kind of uh, jazzed up a little bit with some more UI elements. And then we can go down here and look at all of our unbundled email. This is basically your filters and labels from, from your, you know, uh, old Gmail or the previous 
type of Gmail, whatever you want to call it now. It's getting kind of weird. But basically, you got bundles, you got reminders, you've got pinning, and you've got all kind of good stuff. So now what I'm going to do is jump on over to the mobile app and show you what it looks like over there. All right, guys, so now what you're looking at is the mobile version of the Inbox app. So as you saw earlier with the desktop version, it looks very similar. You have your bundles like social and finance and things like that. And I can break those down and I can select specific emails just like this. And then by selecting those, I can even sweep those away by clicking the check mark at the top or I can hit the pin button at the top and that will also pin those specific emails. So as you see here, I can kind of scroll through my different social emails from that specific bundle by just swiping my finger over. I can do the same uh, under updates here. If I select those, I can kind of pin that down and select specific emails and then check those to mark them as red. Uh, so I can do all of that. Uh, so you got the same thing here. If we flare it out, we see the different uh, bundles that we have. So it looks very similar. You can hit that check mark at the top to only show you the pinned emails that you have pinned. Uh, do that by selecting that little uh, lever there at the top. So basically, guys, my thoughts on this are I really like it. It's going to take a a little getting used to, uh, you know, checking this plus sign down there and then hitting compose like that. I mean, it's going to take a little while to get the different nuances of the app, but I really do like it. I do think this is the future of email. Maybe not this app, but this kind of form of uh, kind of bringing your emails together, letting you see more of them, putting them in specific categories and only having to deal with important emails. So yeah, I think that this is definitely where email is going to go. Let me know what you think in the comment box below. Don't forget, uh, click the link below uh, for an invite to uh, Gmail inbox and let me know what you think. Have you used it? Do you want to use it? Do you like Gmail as it is? Uh, or, or is this something that completely, uh, offends you and you're like, this looks terrible. Let me know in the comment box below. Uh, don't forget to visit my Patreon page to support me uh, for really cool stuff uh, in return. Go ahead and like this video, share it with your friends and family, subscribe to my channel. And as always, guys, thank you so much for watching my videos and I will see you in the next one.